Hey guys, it's T here, and yes, I know my background is a little different again. Sorry about that, but I decided to do this video on the ground because it's my natural lighting that's coming into my window is set up weird. So yeah, so I think the background worked out pretty good because my background is pretty kind of cool. But today I am bringing to you guys how to know if she's a gold digger. So, <laughs> yeah, I know. So some guy, um, a few days ago, he commented on one of my videos and said most black women are gold diggers. I highly disagree with that because I don't think gold digging is a necessarily a color thing. And I'm just going to stick to that because it's not a color thing. Like, he sounded so ignorant, though. But so that's what brought me to doing this video, you guys. So. Without further ado, let's get into the video. To know that a female is a gold digger, she will give you plenty of signs that she only with you for your money. And some of them are bold enough to even just tell you, hey, I'm with you for your money. Like some females are bold enough to do that. Like I'm not kidding. Like number one, to you will, she wants expensive things. Like, when you guys go shopping or if you go shopping for her, she want to go shop for herself. She's always buying the most expensive things like Prada and Gucci. Number two, when you guys first meet, don't get me wrong, I don't really think, I don't really know how to say this. This is kind of contradicting because if I meet a guy and we're about to talk and stuff, of course I'm going to ask him about his job and all that. But I ain't going to ask him all about his finances. Number two, she will ask you about your finance status, okay? She will ask, she will be all up in it, a little bit too nosy, okay, for your liking. So when you get that weird feeling when she's asking too much questions about your finances, you better run. You better run like hell, okay? Run, Forrest, run. Number three, she catches an attitude if you don't buy her what she wants. Number four, every event she go to or you guys go to together, it requires a new outfit. But I thought that was just a girl thing, to be honest. Like, number five, if you guys go out, she never pays for anything. I mean, every once in a while, your girl can treat you, pay for a meal or something. But this chick, nope. She's a gold digger. Number six, you notice she actually don't have a career. Number seven, the most obvious thing is, if her friends are gold diggers, then she's a gold digger. Most of the time, it's like that, okay? So, if her friends are gold diggers, there you go. Number eight, if you guys are having a casual conversation and you guys find nothing to talk about because you have nothing in common, that's a good sign. Number nine, if you notice that all the men that she has dated has money. And number 10, she only gives you sex when you buy her something or she gives you sex so you can buy her something. So you guys, Beware of the gold diggers, all right? Don't get caught up in that. I mean, don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong with treating your woman nice and buying her nice things and taking her to nice restaurants, but it gets to a point where it's like, okay, is she truly with me for me or she's with me for my money? If you're not that attractive or you know you're, like, out of her league, red flag. Okay, and you got money, but that's a red flag, honey. Guys, thanks for watching my video. If you agree with any of these, please give this video a nice thumbs up. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.